Welcome Daily Dozers, I'm Chad Brown, the youth pastor here. Today we are in Ephesians chapter four, verse 29 through 32. Grab your babies, your Bibles, and your juice like we got ours today. Are you ready? Let's go. Ephesians chapter four, 29 through 32. Let's read. Do not let any unwholesome talk come out of your mouths, but only what is helpful, helpful for building others up according to their needs, that it may benefit those who listen. And do not grieve the Holy Spirit of God with whom you were sealed for the day of redemption. Get rid of all bitterness, rage, and anger, brawling and slander, along with every form of malice. Be kind and compassionate to one another, forgiving each other, just as in Christ, God forgave you. So when I first read this passage, it reminded me of when we talked about thinking before you speak in our series a few months back, My Big Fat Mouth. It was part of DeRay's sermon. And like I said, he used this acronym, THINK. The T in the acronym stands for, is it true? The H, is it helpful? I, is what you're saying inspiring? N, is what you're saying necessary? And K, is it kind? So we're gonna give you an example of what not to do when talking to others. Hey! Hey, you! You cotton-headed nitty muggins! You better go the speed limit! See, that's not, uh, <laughs> that's not how we should do it. Was that so. helpful or inspiring or kind? No. No. No, but sometimes we just get in our emotions, mm -hmm. right? So, here's the thing. I love that acronym. Take that, apply it to your life. The, the main thing we want to get across to you today is speak life into other people mm -hmm. and into yourself, right? Don't speak words of death, speak words of life. Love you guys. See you soon. Thank you.